and welcome back to Philly Sports Spotlight. You know, this next story is for all you Michael Vick haters who believe that Vick has lost a step. Now, I'll be the first to agree that Mike may not be as fast as he once was, but recently he proved he's still fast enough. You see, during one of the Eagles' recent organized training activities, Vic challenged running back LaShawn McCoy to a 40-yard 40 40 dash after McCoy kept calling Vic old man. Well, you know the old adage, respect your elders? LaShawn probably should have heeded that warning because Vic apparently smoked shady. Size-wise, there's not a lot of difference between their bodies, but Vic is 32 and McCoy is 24. So uh, apparently uh, the old man still has a little something-something in the tank. Now, while Vic was proving who was king of his domain, the Eagles organization was helping 230 area high school children capture their king, as in their uh, 10th annual chess tournament, which was held at Lincoln Financial Field. Eagles players matched up against students in an event sponsored by the After School Activities Partnerships and the Eagles Youth Partnership uh, students. I said high school, but there were also kids ranging uh, in age from second grade all the way up to ninth grade and then on to 12th grade. Kind of one of those things that the Eagles do that that uh, by giving back to the community and attracts a lot of attention. Uh, by the way, I think the kids mo won most of those uh, chess matches. You know, over time, many NFL players have made the transition from football to film. I'm going to go old school on you. Jim Brown, O.J. Simpson, Howie Long, Brian Bosworth. Just to name a few. Well, now maybe we can add former Eagle Jeremiah Trotter to the mix, as the Axeman recently made his acting debut in a locally made film called North Star. Here's the movie trailer. Ladies and gentlemen, I stand before you a thief and a robber. I stole this head, this body, and these limbs from my master. Be hard on slaves in Mississippi. Y'all boys want to be free. And you don't want to be a slave for the rest of your life like me. And we're no closer to laying hands on these than we were a week ago. If you bring back Big Ben Jones unharmed, Big ben Jones. I will pay you $3,000. $3,000, sir. <laughs> we can help you. <laughs> you gonna throw yourself back into danger like that? That woman could have been our sister. Oh, uh, mama. She just us a few weeks ago. I believe the Lord put me here for a reason. Any slave master has a right by law to enter these free states and claim what they assume to be their property. Conductors have found out that they will be raided in three days. you gonna see that they're gonna be the North Star. Follow the drinking gourd. Uh, that movie, by the way, North Star, was shot last summer in Bucks County and directed by former Central Bucks West High School graduate uh, Thomas K. Phillips and took only 24 days to film. All right, when we return, we'll explain why this video has Sixers fans a, a bit ticked off, if you will. <laughs> 